I want to say because I was having lunch with friends not long ago who are quizzing me about um, AI and we had an interesting conversation and I want to point out that um, in these times of increasing invasion of a digital world and this AI that I believe most of us barely understand but we see manifestations of it and we become aware how it's already affecting our lives and will continue to affect our lives more and more. Um, I brought up the experience that I had of being in the, the first uh, art immersive experience created by this group of French uh, technological brilliant guys. Um, and it was about Klimt in Paris a few years ago. Then that technique has been um, licensed and it's traveling the world. And now there are these art immersive experiences happening everywhere. They are all, to me, a bit of science fiction. And I often ponder uh, as these events become more and more popular, how they may affect in the long run the perception and the relationship that people have with the actual work of art when you close and you see the humor in the painting and you see uh, the strokes in the palette and, and uh, as you move you see the details and it takes a life of its own the closer you are to it and the more you allow yourself to be quiet with it. Um, so what I want to say is that being here in this show, uh, it's, a, it's a very physical, sensory, sensual, elevated form of ex experience. And it's truly an authentic, immersive experience, not one created by technology. And, um, I want to say I'm grateful for the appreciation that I have in my life for art. And I'm grateful for this precious opportunity that this show provides because of its quality and um, its uh, resonance and its impact on the viewers.